Good morning, YouTube. So, today is kitchen renovation time. <sighs> that stove is so outdated. My cabinets are outdated. Everything is just outdated. So, what we're doing is we're going to be literally starting with the cabinets. So I'll be getting all the updates to the stove and the microwave and everything a little bit later, but I wanted to show you what I started with today, and please just disregard the mess, because I live in the real world where I work, and in my free time, I got to take care of stuff around the house. So, um, what I'm doing is I'm redoing my cabinets, repainting them, actually, and watched a few videos and got some great ideas on how to redo my cabinets. So, I'm actually starting from the top, and what you see is I've taken them off of the hinges and I've already primed the boxes and I did not take everything out of the cabinets because no one will see the inside so there is no point in me doing that but I wanted to share with you what I'll be using what I'm going to be using or what I've used thus far in my very um broken down cans with all the color on them um, we have the Zinsser Prime Coat Primer and Sealer, and the paint itself is the General Finishes Snow White Water Based Milk Paint. And once I complete painting, I'll be putting this General Finishes High Performance Top Coat um, on them. These are water based paints, and I'll put the link below where I purchased it. And you'll be able to see thus far what I will be doing. Now, what you can see on the table is that I've done the fronts of the top cabinets already. So it gives a really nice, beautiful white finish. And I haven't put the top coat on these yet, so I did about um, two to three coats on top of these. And I did the front and I did the back as well, as you will see. And I'll be putting another coat on the back of that. This one's dry. Um, you also see I have these little, these great little um, painter's pyramids that I purchased. And they're awesome because you just, you know, stand them up like this. And literally, you may sit your item right on top and it makes a nice little, you know, stand for your items on the table. Great invention, great investment. So you all will see that I have done quite a few tops here for the top part of my shelves and I'll come back to you with the finished product all right you all so this is my finished product in my kitchen all right that's the white cabinets I did I haven't put all of the um, hardware on the cabinets yet so I will finish putting those on as well Got those from Home Depot, I believe, or actually I may have gotten them from Amazon, but I also replaced my stove and the microwave. I just went with white. I just really prefer the white. I also added this easy peel and stick backsplash. It's probably the easiest thing I ever put up ever. And um, I got that from Lowe's and it just adheres. You don't have no difficulty to it at all. It looks very real. Um, I just thought it added a nice touch and added some texture and, and you know, a contrast with all the white that I have going on in the kitchen. So again, here are my cabinets. Don't mind my stuff on my counter, please. And the other thing I did, you may have noticed, and I'm gonna turn off the lights so you can see, is I added lights under the cabinet. So I got these lights 
as you see, they're actually battery operated lights. And I got them from um, Costco. I was in Costco and I thought, oh, that's pretty cool. And let me see if it, you know, will do what I want it to do. So I'm gonna turn them on so you can see them. And what's really kind of cool about these lights, you can put them in any direction. They're battery operated. And when we had the hurricanes here in Florida, came in pretty handy. You can make them brighter. You can also check this out, change the color. We got red. It may not look red to you guys, but it actually is red. And we have blue and we have green. So that's pretty cool. You know, with Christmas coming, that'll work out just fine for me with the old green thing. But you can, of course, always go with your white and you can increase the brightness or you can dim them. And as you see, I dimmed it a little bit there. But yeah, they're pretty cool. And they come with a little remote control, as you see right here. And it controls everything. And there's also a timer on them as well. So, love them. Really a great little feature. And again, you know, this was a cute little project I did. I just wanted to update things. I really like it. My kitchen overall. <laughs> Don't look at all the stuff on my counter. Um, on my table. But this is my complete kitchen. It's eating kitchen. And uh, still cleaning and things like that. But this is what it looks like, you guys. If you have any questions at all, please feel free to comment and ask questions and I'll give you anything I can. I did it all by myself. I actually literally tried to get my daughter to help me. She did a little bit of painting, but not much. And one of her friends came over as well and they helped out a little bit, but took everything off the hinges and painted away. It took about two days, but I am very happy with the results. And, uh, when everything is actually complete, um, I'll let you guys see. All right, YouTube, have a wonderful day. Bye.